And David, that's right. After many complaints about drivers parking in this designated bike lane, police realized it's not against the law. So the city started adding these no parking signs right under the bike lane signs, hoping that will give police some enforcement. Next, city council will introduce an ordinance to make it clear for everyone. Take a look. This is video as in June we started tracking the concerns as Scott Blake and others worked with police to get drivers off the bike lanes. And we were there as the city added these no parking signs to the street in order for police to enforce. It's a $16 ticket for violators, but it's still a problem. That's why Councilman Pete Festerson will introduce an ordinance Tuesday, hoping to make it clear for everyone. Now the updated code would allow police to up to give $32 tickets to drivers parked in those bike lanes. From police to city leaders to those on two wheels, everyone tells us they're proud of the quick progress. This was consistently every Sunday uh, blocking several feet when they had adequate parking on the other side. We were kind of surprised it wasn't actually already in there. It's kind of self-evident, I think, but it is an important thing to clarify as we try to build out our biking and pedestrian infrastructure throughout the city. Again, the first reading for this ordinance is November 5th. Then there's a public hearing November 19th. Then the council will vote on that the week after that. Police tell us if this ordinance becomes law, don't worry. They will not start ticketing drivers yet. They'll give warnings first. Live in Dundee tonight, Chin Doan, KETV Newswatch 7.